Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Gizzy Gaz Show, starring Gizzy Gaz. Hey there, folks. It's me, Gizzy Gaz, and I'm here to give you some advice, which I hope you find nice. So that you'll want to hear it twice, you can hit rewind and play. So uh, on with my advice for today. about fixing my thumb. I said, put some gum on it. And they said, well, how is making my gu- my thumb sticky going to help the situation? And I told them, I said, listen, I'm talking about sucking your thumb. If it's sore, put a little gum on it. You don't have to worry about it. It's going to be nice and, and soft and chewy for a little while. And you just gum on it for a little while and your thumb will start to feel better. Trust me on that. It might look like you just got out of the tub after about an hour, but Tell me if your thumbs feel much better after that. You know, I may be a little slow, but I get there. Uh, People are always telling me, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I say, I'll be with you shortly, because I'm not tall. I have to say, I try to stay out of trouble as much as I can. You know, I did get in trouble there when I was younger. I I, I broke into a bakery, and I I got arrested for delicious destruction got to be careful what you ask for. When I was younger, I used to always want a, a pair of boobs to hold. Now I have a pair of boobs of my own. And I don't know what ha- I don't know how I got them. I, I don't know if it's just something I ate or something I shouldn't have ate. That's probably what, something I didn't eat. I'm not sure about that, but definitely got them boobs. You know, some people, to, to keep protection, they use dog straps. I, I invented a mini hammock. It's crazy. The older I get, it seems that my, uh, it's, put it this way, they hang about almost down to my feet, right about now. It's awful. The older I get, it seems that uh, it's almost like I, uh, I'd be taller if I could stand upon them. You know what I'm saying? You got to be careful. You got to be careful now. You know. Your balls hang low. One of my lady friends, not necessarily a woman, just one of my lady friends, had, had a, definitely the other day won a contest, and I was real proud of her. Um, the only problem was, in order to win the prize, she had to describe herself stripping. So she went on to tell me about how she she took out her false teeth, and then she uh. She took off her bra and one of her boobs hit the floor, so she had to throw it over her shoulder. And then she had to take off her darn panty. And uh, the way she described it, uh, made sort of like a noise and it was quite embarrassing to all the people around. So, nevertheless, uh, if it was me, I would not enter a contest such as this. That's all I'm saying. 
You know what I'm saying? I don't. If you do, let me know. Thank you. I had some folks telling me their ears were sore. I said, put a little pee on it. And they looked at me like I, like I was sick in the head, which I do look sick in the head anyway, but that's not the point. I, well, P for me stands for peroxide, of course. So when I say put some P on it, I, I, I don't mean PP. I mean peroxide. Here's this darn song in my head. It goes, wibble wobble do, dribble dobble do, scribble scrabble, and a dibble dabble dibble my poo. Something like that. You know what song? You, you ever, I think you might remember it. Well, what I mean is now that I'm saying it. <laughs> you know, I never seem to win at scratch tickets. And I'm getting really old about it. Now listen, I, I figured out, I think I know what to do. Okay, and, I, and I'm not trying to accuse anybody, but something's got to be done here. It seems like somebody that's at a store, now hopefully they don't do this, but they could... They could turn around, buy that scratch ticket, and then, without even scratching it, scan it, see if it's a winner or a loser, and then if it's a loser, they could resell it. It, it. It's just not right. It's just not right. You know, I don't believe in scratch tickets. I wish they'd come out with a scratch ticket that would scratch my behind, but right now, I need, it's my behind, would you please? Please, please, I can't reach you no more. I desire to be prosperous, want to make things better for us. How do I think? How do I believe? How do I give? Time to live. How do I speak? How do I work? How do I spend? Ask to friends. How do I stand? How do I recover? Treat everyone like a sister or a brother. Don't be a hater, be a life lover. Instead of always thinking about the things I regret, I'm seeing a vision of what's to come yet. I'm tired of talking. I want to do some walking. Then put in a plan to do action. Lord willing, I succeed. Life, love, love, have no hope, have given me every tool I'll ever need. Do some walking. I'm gonna do what I'm talking. I'm talking. I'm 